In this video, I will be going over the two of the cranial bones in a quiz style video with tags on them, two that are not on the cap of the skull. So the two bones that you can see inside of the skull. Or that, uh, that's what I will be going over today in a quiz style video. So follow along, write down your answers, and then the second half of this video will be me going over the answers. So inside here, you can see I have two different colored tape. The pipe cleaner also, for future reference, if you don't know already, is used to identify holes. So my first question is, looking at all the green tape, what bone is the green tape identifying features on? I'll show you around, so hopefully you have a good idea. So that's question one, is what bone is the green tape identifying features on? The second question is going to be a bony ID. And it's that. It's number two. Hopefully you were able to see what was tagged. Number three is pointing to this feature. Number four is tagged on that feature. Number five is here. You can only see it from the posterior, or sorry, the inferior view. And then six is on the other side. Question seven is a not an ID. The question is, um, what do five and six make up? So if you put those bony features together, what is the name of that? Number eight is this feature. Let me show you from both sides. And then number nine is this feature. So that's one bone. Go back if you need, but now I'm going to move on to the other bone that's tagged in red. So question number one for this one is what bone am I uh, tagging features on in red? Now let's go over IDs. So number two is what is the feature number two is pointing to? might be helpful to then look at three and see that number three is pointing to a longer structure. Number four, and turn it inside the nasal cavity like this. See number four in here is in red. right in the middle. And then number five, you can see on the side. All right. 
pause the video if you need, go back if you need to check any of your answers. Now I'm gonna go over them. So first, all the IDs tagged in green is the sphenoid bone. Number two, this bony feature is the cella tersica. Number three, this is the lesser wing. And number four is the greater wing. Five, it's gonna be your lateral pterygoid plate. Number six, it's gonna be your medial pterygoid plate. Together, makes up a pterygoid process. So a lateral and a medial plate make up a process. Number eight, this is gonna be your optic foramen. Coming out most superiorly. Number nine is gonna be your superior orbital fissure, just below that. The second bone, tagged in red, is the ethmoid bone. Number two, this feature is the Christogalli. Number three, that surrounds the Christogalli, is a cribiform plate. Number four, that was right in the middle, that's gonna be your perpendicular plate. And just next to that, the most superior one that you can see is going to be your middle nasal concha. The superior nasal concha is also a, a part of the ethmoid bone, but you can't see it on the models. I hope that was helpful.